So in this lecture, we will see the patch managers and patch base name. So let us see that service in systems manager. You can see your patch manager and in that we can create some patches to automate our instances. So here you can see in the left right side in node management, there is a patch manager. Just click on it. <clears throat> So this is your uh, patch manager okay what you can do you can create a patch policy or you can start with an overview you can create patch policy you can view dashboard or view compliance reports also so let us see this how can we create a patch policy here okay so here is how you can create a patch manager actually this is the dashboard and this is where you can just uh, place your Amazon EC2 instance management. Here are your patch baselines and these patch baselines are actually made by like AWS. So they, these are some predefined uh, patch baselines which is made by AWS and you can create your own patch baseline. And here are the patches you can see. Okay, here are the patches and suppose if I go for run and i just enter it okay sorry you can you can search for amazon linux 2 here and yeah in this i can run patch baseline it was so i can search it and i'll, I'll just get it in some pages suppose in one two three four there's plenty of pages and i can get that run patch baseline in any of that pages right so here how you can create your patch and you can select your patch and you can automate the service so, so this is how you can do that next is your man maintenance windows okay this maintenance windows is actually used to automate the uh, patch manager right so the tasks that you are uh, automating through patch manager that will be scheduled and implemented across your fleet so you can create a maintenance window from here and suppose this is my maintenance window i can name it like demo patch i can name it and i can specify or schedule it with cron schedule builder rate schedule builder cron rate expression or uh, with cron schedule builder i can like specify that when i want it to just automate the task uh, by default it is uh, every 30 minutes i can do it hourly or daily so this is daily at every day at suppose uh, 3 am i want that okay so duration i want the setting anything and i can just create maintenance window okay here is the duration so if you want maintenance window duration so i can take one value here yeah and here i can take one or two i guess yeah so here is my value i can take anything and now what i'll be doing i'll be creating a maintenance window from here okay and cutoff is actually one hour only so i must select this two and yeah okay okay just just let us take this Okay, so that is how we can create one maintenance window and i have just named it like i just when i was creating if you can see the detail it is the description duration is 14 hours cut off point was 11 hours before window closes so it must be like in between less than that cut off time less must be less than the duration okay and it should be between 1 to uh, 23 right so this is my next execution time which will be executed on sunday march 24 at 1 a.m utc right so that is how i can make and here if i want to automate all these tasks in maintenance window i can just register some tasks from here and suppose this is my run command task and from here i want to uh, like demo i want to take and here 
one will be AWS and run and let's enter and yeah, run patch baseline and it should select it. That would be better. AWS and run patch and yeah here it is i can also select this one i can use this one this the document which is run patch baseline and i can set thanks to this rate control i can set the concurrency so it can be one suppose and this error should be one i i have to put any values if you are not putting it will show you error so you have to put any of the values here and next what i'll be doing doing Is just with this swing run command okay oh i haven't selected any target yet so you can select any of the unregistered targets or any of the targets if you want right so you can do it manually or you can select any of the targets and you can create your run command task and it will just be completed right so I am not going to run this because uh, I have just told you and just explained you that how we can uh, work on this run command task. But I don't have any targets. I don't have any instances right now. So I cannot run this uh, command task. So that is how you can work on maintenance window and patch manager. So I hope this was clear to you. Let's meet in our next video. video thank you.